This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Principles, Unit 5, Building Apps, Lesson 10, Building an App, Color Sleuth, Puzzle 27, AP Practice, Create PT Algorithm. One component of the AP Create Performance task is describing an algorithm within your program, a very critical component, not only of the performance task, but of programming. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Um, yep, written responses can't be more than 200 words, which I'm sometimes bad at. Uh, here's two rows of the scoring guide. Select code segment implements an algorithm that uses mathematical like equals and minus and times or logical operators like uh, the quality operator less than equal to um, and and so on and so forth. Select code segment implements an algorithm that includes at least two or more algorithms. Ooh, at least one includes and included use of mathematical and logical yep uh concepts explains how one of the included functions work independently all right this code selection is yep here are the main points make sure to include name your main algorithm in each of the two sub algorithms okay so the code over here what's calling the other functions that's going to be the main algorithm and if you're looking through this set board switch player is called right here so so the main algorithm check correct calls both of the sub algorithm set board and switch player explain what each sub algorithm does how the code of each actually works okay set board we're declaring these variables all right so this is my answer yep the main algorithm check correct calls both sub algorithms set board and switch player the sub algorithm set board assigns the color for each button it does this by using the variables rgb each of which are assigned a random number between 0 and 235. It creates the color on line 36, then it creates random color by adding 20 to R, G, B, and assigns it to a new variable different color. So just kind of taught, walking through that mathematical process of adding, and then also the variable assignment, uh, or well, reassignment, or redefinition, reassignment. The function switch player, because we have to talk about both functions, make sure you talk about both switch player and set board, is used to highlight a new element in the UI user interface using an if statement. The set board function is checking the choice is the set board function is checking if a choice is correct and then oh, I should have said that the check correct function is checking if a choice is correct and then updates the game board for the next round, which is our main function. That is my answer. Um, plagiarism matters. Do not just copy my answer. That is plagiarism. But walking through this, talking about these, it's always helped me in the past. It's helped my students. So that's what this is. Make sure your answer is in your own words and your own thoughts. All right, onward.